So, you know, I don't want to say everything has been solved. And that's kind of the joke. Every time we think that everything's been done, someone comes out and does something new, right? It's like, oh, big tech, what is big tech anymore? And then AI companies come out. Now you have like chat GPT is a new concept. But I do stand by the philosophy that the hardest problems are not solved, at least at this level. Like if you're probably watching this as a college student or early in your career looking to pivot, the types of roles you're looking for, you know, correct me if I'm wrong, is a steady life, a great paycheck, and a good kind of like work-life balance solving hard problems, but not the hardest problems. Because if you wanted to solve the hardest problems, you'd be an academic. You'd be pursuing a PhD in some niche, niche area, or you'd be a research scientist. Like, you know, the, the people at OpenAI really working with the models are not entry-level software engineers, right? Entry-level software engineers are building, are building out the billing tool or the API integration or, uh, you know, growth engineers to make the distribution better. Like, I work at LinkedIn as an ads engineer, right? Ads fundamentally as a problem of like bidding, pricing, audience, distribution, impressions, a lot of that came from academic papers that someone at LinkedIn 10, 15 years ago implemented a V1 of, and now we just iterate on that. Nothing wrong with that, but software engineer today is about solving little problems. And the little problems might not be the most technical, 